Hi, this is Gray with another Manufacturing Minute. Today let's talk about the Deming Chain Reaction. A lot of manufacturers are familiar with this from practicing continual improvement, but it may be new for some folks. Deming was Dr. W. Edwards Deming. He was one of the renowned experts on quality improvement. Look him up, especially his 14 points. He was born 112 years ago this week, on October 14, 1900, and he passed away in 1993. But Deming's chain reaction traces what happens when we focus on improving quality at every level of production. And it works like this. Improve the quality, and it leads to lower cost of production, because there's less waste and less rework. There are fewer mistakes, better use of your resources. All of these things lead to higher production. Because you think about it, if you have a hundred unit capacity, but only 85 units are any good, then you have to rework or scrap those other 15, and that costs more than if you hadn't made those units at all. So what if you could make 95 or 99 or even a hundred units good the first time? So if you put together that higher production at lower cost, then you can beat the competition with better products at lower prices. Beating the competition means staying in business with jobs for today and jobs for the future. That's the Deming chain reaction, and it starts with improving quality. If you want to know more about Deming or about improving quality of your products, send us a note at the MFG Minute at ncsu.edu. Thanks.